this track is, uh, has been in its current state since about 1989. The track here, which I've coached kids on this track, and it's terrible. In 1989, they tore it up and made it all cinders, but one of the things that they had to do was uh, preserve the baseball field, and so that's why you ended up with an egg that it is there. So it's, it's remained that way for 31 years. It's part of being a, a 1A facility, um, and you know, that isn't ripe with a lot of money to make a lot of changes. the high school track, well, whole school track. Um, it's a little bit not the right shape. <laughs> um, it's sand, obviously. And yeah, there's our football field right there. Then we just make it work with what we have. It's really a pipe dream for a small town like this to do a, a multi-million dollar expansion and upgrade. It kind of blows my mind and I, I think back of the movie, Field of Dreams. I mean, to really put something together like this in this place is uh, kind of a miracle. We haven't seen a track meet here since 1974. Even just the idea of hosting a meet and you know, being the person that kind of started it, is like, it's so mind-boggling to me. Cause like I said, I'm just like a small town girl. It, my world isn't that big, but the fact that I can pull something like this off is so exciting. If you build it, they will come. Sound familiar? It's exactly what the small rural town of Maupin is banking on. We have a project that is beyond our means. Um, I believe we have the project team that will make it within our means. Situated 90 miles north of Bend, 40 miles south of the Dalles, with a population of less than 500, Maupin is known by most people for one thing, rafting. But one teenage girl with a dream and a community with a vision plan on changing that. So I think I had the idea when I was in eighth grade. Um, it was just, you know, hey, why don't, why don't we have a real track? Why hasn't someone done this? And then, you know, my parents were like, well, why don't you be the problem solver and you be the person that makes it happen? She really has been the catalyst that, to start with that pushed this project and said, you know, why, why can't we just do something better? It sounds straight out of a Hollywood script for a Field of Dreams sequel, but with Holly Miles replacing Kevin Costner as the lead. Like, it, it was just a tiny idea, and I'm just a girl from a small town, and then there's this thing happening, and I'm like this seedling of it, I guess. It has created so much excitement in town. I hear, when I'm walking the streets, people ask me about it, and I'm like, oh, you probably should talk to Holly. I may be the athletic director, but I mean, this is, is bigger than just an athletic director thing. The idea is to transform the current triangle-shaped cinder surface school track into a world-class athletic facility, with the centerpiece being an Olympic track with breathtaking views. We're sitting over the Deschutes River. It's the best view in the world. So you walk over here, though, and you actually get the perspective, and you look out over here to the Deschutes River and the rim rock, and it sinks in. And that's where you go, wow. Yeah, this is, an, this is an incredible location. And upgrading this facility to a world-class track with a good surface and a rail so that we can have, so that we can have uh, international uh, events here has so much potential because it is such a beautiful location. It's fun to dream what the future could hold. Elite runners training in Maupin, records being broken overlooking the Deschutes, camps being hosted, concerts on the infield, and more. But perhaps sweetest of all is the simple fact that South Wasco County High School could host their first home track meet 
in 45 plus years. I, I think they're, if we could put on a home track meet, uh, you know, our community is going to rally around that. They're going to get excited. If you build it, they will come. Holly believes, Moppin believes, former Nike executives, and Portland Track believes. Maybe, just maybe, the track of dreams will come true. To me, it's just like, it's, it was an idea, it was a dream, and now it's becoming a reality, and when it's done, it will be the field of dreams, because that's what it was. It started as a dream, and now it's, you know, gonna be big. Field of Dreams. In Moppin, Eric Lindstrom, Central Oregon Daily News.